Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. This is Markeisha and I'm here to share with you guys some projects that are very dear to me. I have been wanting to make the headbands for my little baby, uh, my little grandbaby Paris Marie and I finally um, took the plunge and decided to make some. So let me show you the supplies that I used. I picked this ribbon up here, it's $2.99 from Hobby Lobby and it's that stretch um, ribbon that you can use to make the headbands. My little grandbaby, she you know, still doesn't have a lot of hair so I am accessorizing and so I got it in the cream. And so because this was my first time uh, making these, I only got those two colors to kind of play around with them but I'm really happy the way they came out. So let me just go ahead and show you guys the first one that I created and it's this one here and I used the cream um, color um, stretchy headband and I just put some rosettes on it and Michael's is, I mean I'm sorry, <laughs> Hobby Lobby is now carrying this gorgeous trim so I didn't have peach and so I picked that up and that's what I used to put on this headband here and I thought this headband, I know it's a little bit dressy but I, I felt like she could wear this to church or you know out if I wanted to kind of dress her up and so I got it in the peach also made it in the cream and again just three rosettes the stretchy headband material there and I use this one here from Hobby Lobby and I'm really glad they've started getting these and it was $4.99 and of course I got it when it was 50% off and so I got that and so I just made this one I really really love this um, those headbands. Those again are pretty much for like the dress, you know, if I wanted to dress her up. This one here is, I have this bow, and I love that Hobby Lobby has those little um, kind of project idea little pamphlets that hangs down, and so if you go over there in the bow section, they have little pamphlets that kind of show you how to make bows. And so this one here has this really cute, fun bow with a, this is kind of like some Valentine, um, material here and so you can just kind of put this on. I really haven't perfected um, doing these. These were some bows that I had um, already and I just decided to put these on to the headbands and so I'm still practicing on making those bows and then again this is a bow I had and I just you know put it on here so she has lots of pink and cream right now <laughs> And I have to uh, pick up some more of that um, that trim, and they had it in several colors. So now that I kind of feel like I got, you know, I'm, I'm a little bit okay with it. I think that I can do some more. And I got this because I really love the green and pink, and I just put it on the cream. And so I have those. And then while I was being so crafty, <laughs> I started kind of looking around. And you guys may remember this. This was a bookmark that I made. And um, I decide, decided to make this a pacifier holder. So I have the pacifier holder on the back. I just took it and added some lace, uh, you know, for that. And then I added a little stretchy... Um, attachment here that the pacifier you know all I have to do is take it and um, take this and you know kind of wrap it through here and I have a pacifier um, attachment and so of course again this is pretty dressy this is something she wouldn't really wear every day um, I added two flowers and some bling and I had a bling centerpiece already in the front there and if I find something where I can put her name there Paris since you know it's um, not that long I'm, if I can find like a little name plate or something then I'll put it there but this is my favorite trim here just some satin um, pink ribbon and then this one here and I always say this kind of reminds me of like a chapel or church ribbon I don't know why but <laughs> I like that ribbon and so this is just a little pacifier holder that she would have and again this is just something that she can have if I wanted to dress her up um, pretty girly and you can tell guys I had all boys and um, you know I, I really love adding pinks and creams and all kind of stuff really shabby chic um, I come from a house my mom had four girls so you know having boys is totally new to me 
but I just, I think I almost got that down pack. I'm almost with the emptiness, so <laughs> thanks guys so much for watching. I am trying to, um, again, kind of do some um, baby items, something to kind of personalize for my little sweet baby, and I will insert a photo, a recent photo of her, so you guys can see she is now two months, and of course she is one of the joys of my life. And if you follow me on Instagram, you know that I post uh, pictures quite often of her. And uh, I will put a link down to my Instagram, which is really just Staple M1, the same as my YouTube channel. So thanks guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.